Hi, I'm John Storms and uh, I'm going to show you how I test out my controllers. I like to uh, test out my controllers at the beginning of each season. I use the Lightarama CTB16. First thing I do is you open up the cover. Make sure this is off. Plug in the controller. Then I turn it on. When I turn it on, what I'm watching for is I'm watching for that red light. See it? You're watching for that red LED. That tells you that it thinks it's working okay. Of course, the next step, step is to go through and start attaching Christmas lights. First of all, I'm going to attach this to my computer, which has the Lightorama 3.0 software installed. So I take the little USB 45B connector, which goes from USB to the Cat5 wire. Plug that into my laptop. I plug this in like that. And then what I'll do is I'll make sure that the software can recognize it. Okay, so I just plugged in my controller. So I come in here and I find my Lightarama software. I go to the Lightarama hardware. And it says it's founded on device three. So the next thing I want to do is hook up the lights. Okay, so now we have the rig all set up. We have all uh, 16 channels plugged into a different set of lights. Now we can start the test. So we come here. And we have COM port. It says it's found on COM port 3. So now I want to go to the console and I select the unit ID that I have which is unit 2 and I say all on. See? See? They all turn on. Now if my um, unit ID was set improperly, these wouldn't turn on, so that's another thing I'm checking for. So, first test is turn them all on, then we say twinkle, shimmer, and then effect off, and then all on. And we say all on, and we also make sure that they all dim and come back up. So, this is how we make sure each of the ports work. Now, if you really want to test it out really well and you're very suspicious, you could write a special sequence that would go and t turn on each one individually, ramp it up, ramp it down, and do it in various combinations. Um, but for my purposes, this is, uh, this is all I'm doing. So that's my test. Hi, I'm John Storms. I'm going to show you another way to, to test the Lightarama controller. So what I've done is I've hooked up um, my controller number six to my computer via the adapter and a USB cable. So I go to the Lightarama Hardware Utility. Lightarama, Lightarama Hardware. Okay. And you select the unit, just as easy as putting in the ID there. And then you say, on at 100%. And you make sure that all the lights are on. Then you can do a shimmer, you can do a twinkle, you can do a fade. I like to, since I do LEDs, I like to do the fade a little bit slower just to see if I'm getting any significant flickering. Okay. And then you can also run through a nice little chase sequence where it turns them all off, turns them back on. Turns them back on. And you can say while you're doing this, do a shimmer. While you're doing that, do a twinkle. And you're basically looking to make sure that every single channel is doing something. Okay. So for me, I consider the best test just to be the on at 100%. And then you look to see if there's any lights that are on. They're all there. Then you know your test is good. So then you turn it off, you disconnect everything.